Hey guys, crew of Blind Wave, I'm Eric. I'm Shane. Naren. And we're back with Star Wars Resistance. Mm. Last time on Star Wars Resistance, there was an attack. Yes, there was. They sab sabotage. Sonara, yeah. Yeah. Well, I guess they didn't sabotage. They knew that stuff was down because yeah. it was already broken, and yeah. then they just gave hints. Yep. So they didn't um, sabotage it. Tam and Sonara bonded. Mm -hmm. Right. Yes, uh, she risked her life for Sonara, and Sonara's like, you came for me? And she's mm -hmm. like, yeah. So, like, maybe she can be good, kind of hinting. So, I, think she, I think she's turning to the good guys now, but yeah. it's going to be one of those things where she's going to be a situation where she chooses not to tell them, or chooses to tell them, it'll be a dilemma. And, of course, our heroes will find out anyways. Yes. Mm -hmm. She'll look like the bad guy, she'll get cast out, and then she'll come back and save the day, <gasps> redeeming herself, something like that. Aww. <laughs> you know? Like Han, when he comes back, he's like, that ah, jerk left! And yeah. Like, ah, well, it. yeah, but I think they'll kick her out, maybe. Or, or she'll be cast out. Like, okay. and, and, you know what I mean? Like, maybe she'll choose to leave. Gotcha. You doing? Looking for a poll we had last oh. time. Um, and then we also had the whole... Just texting. <laughs> I mean, I'm just what you're doing. First order proposal. The, uh... Yes. Uh, Doza said... Be deep. Hey, yeah. uh, gold man. So does he, <laughs> Give does me the he proposal. Ex ex accept the proposal? Uh -huh. What is it? Captain Fire? Fryer? Something? Pyre. Pyre. That's yep. what it is. Pyre. That was actually the subject of our poll. Do you think Captain Doza will accept the First Order's proposal? Pro proposal. Pro? Proposal. Proposal. 32% said proposal. no. 67% said yes. So, kind of split? No. Oh, that probe. Pierce We're Arner probe. says, I don't think it'll be accepted because then it changes the playing field too much for Kaz's mission. I think he just means story wise. Uh, Definitely proposal. Definitely proposal. Proposal. Is it pro I think it's pro proposal. Just right? said that, yeah. Yeah, okay. Proposal. Dean says, <laughs> Of course he will. He is going to get into a predicament similar to Lando and Vader on Cloud City. Ooh. Once he has given them an inch, they will get a foothold into the Colossus. Dustin Vader said, I thought I would give you guys a little more info about our little yellow janitor friend. But no. His name Spoilers. is O.P. Pitt. O.P. O.P. Pitt. O.P. And he's from the planet Tansil 5. I'm going to call him O.P. He is also the only janitor on the entire Colossus. <laughs> How do you know this? Darth Scorn says he'll accept it, but then they'll come in and start throwing their weight around, and he'll regret it pretty quickly. Then, by the season's end, he'll keep Kaz and Co. He'll help Kaz and Co. Kick them off the platform. Yeah. It's very basic, is what he says. Angry Bob Ross, which I always love saying that name. That's, doesn't... That's like the, electri uh, the Amish electrician. Yes. <laughs> A contradiction. For now, yes, but I'm sure once he sees how they operate, he might change his mind and maybe help the spies report on the first order. Report! Yep. And then, last one, Ted Bishop. Everybody got theirs right today. Uh, I'm guessing he will, though depending on what the First Order is looking for on the station, it could change his tune really quickly. They need the station, but for what? We don't know. We hmm. do not know. Why do they need a refilling station that doesn't have fuel all the time? Right? Didn't the First yeah. Order bring fuel? Uh, they uh, brought uh, fuel and supplies. But yeah. yeah, I don't know what they do there. What's that? We need a pro... It's not propose, right? Propose. Propose. <laughs> No, no, you don't propose, right? Propose? Pro, 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 propose. That was our poll. Propose. We're going to be getting propose. into propose. this reaction. Make sure you guys propose. stick around for the discussion, propose. for the Q&As, for a new poll. All going on right now. Let's do it. We're going to have a race. I want to see more races. Trust me. Yeager is going to be so happy. Yeager. Yeager. Happy. As in happy. You are proposing another... Joke! Am I correct, Gaz? <laughs> okay, gang, keep working on those repairs. Captain Dozer wants to see me about something important. Can we go too, Yeager, please? And what are you smiling about? That's what I want to know. Nothing! <laughs> Nothing at all. Can he spy some information? We should go see what Dozer wants. Saboteurs? The platform classic. Uh, what about it? The classic is a chance to bring much needed money to our economy. The prize is 100,000 credits. So I'm calling on you, Yeager. The best of the best. Yeah? Sorry. My racing days are long over. I knew you'd say that. It's been a long time. I'm sure I don't have to introduce famous sky racer Marcus Speedstar. Three time winner of the five with you too. He's my brother. Oh, shit. Oh. Marcus or Marcus? 
Marcus, I think. My racing days, like my days of dealing with him, are over. Mm -hmm. Now hold on a minute, Jarek. We need to talk, but surprised you'd even agree to this. Hmm. So great to meet you, Marcus. Big fan. I'm Kaz, by the way. Hey! Hey! Room, Kaz. He's the one who taught me to fly when we were kids. You used to be a kid? <laughs> Look, I'm <laughs> busy, and you've got a race to prepare for. I came out to see you. Well, then you wasted your trip. I wonder what happened. Where's this guy? Look at him. <laughs> oh, wait. What? Yeah, spit he on He likes you. us. My name is Niku. This is Kaz and Tam. <laughs> ah, everyone, meet Oplock. I see Oplock is still with you, even after what happened. It's because Oplock forgave me. He judges me on the person I am. Unlike you, Oplock decided to help me through things. Well, it looks like you have him and you have your fame. And you did whatever you had to do to get it. You know you could never beat me. Yeah, but you and I are the only ones that know that. Oh, shit. I didn't realize you were so afraid to race again. Yes, oh. especially against your own brother. Afraid. <laughs> I taught Marcus everything he knows. He couldn't touch me. I'll go challenge him and he'll back down. That's how this always works. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> it's not yeah, often we get so celebrity happy. racers out here. Oh, oh hey. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, great. Guavi and Death Gang. Yes, yeah, oh. Force Awakens. Looks like our little maneuver back on Rishi didn't work like I'd hoped. Rishi. I would have stuck around if I knew it was you fellas. Those 20,000 credits will be all yours. No! I'm blocked. It's okay, I'm blocked. Just go with the nice death game for the next credits. few hours. There isn't a pilot here who stands a chance against me. Marcus! Oh, no. Don't be shy, ladies and generarians. Put your credits down right here. <laughs> That's <Rodian. laughs> Once you agree to race, you can't back out of it. Yeah. You know what he said, like, the first episode? Yeah. And I don't want him to win, because I want that guy to get money. I know. How old is Cat? He's tall. I didn't say what he was best at. I don't know. 16, 17? <laughs> Look at that ship. That's pretty badass. Reorient that cam slider, kid. So you're Jarek's best mechanic? Top three. <laughs> Top three. Actually, I'm a pilot, too. I knew Yeager was at the Battle of Jakku, but... Why did he leave the defense fleet? He never told you? After the war with the Empire, the military downsized. Yeager and I raced for a living. But he was racing for something more. His family? So you know about them? So I juiced up my racer with some hyperfuel. That stuff is it's dangerous. That clipped Yeager's ship and sent the whole race out of control. Why did you stop? Maybe they got people hurt. Hope it was his family, because that is pretty, pretty, pretty unforgivable. We got his family killed. Who's those that know about this stuff? <laughs> yeah, I know about it. You should forgive your brother for whatever he did. You don't know what you're asking of me. But what happened? He's your brother. Look, his mechanic is in trouble with the Guavian Death Gang. He needs that prize money to pay them off. That's not my concern. Hmm. Now we get to see him actually race. And all the aces. Yes! Yeah. I love all the different looks of the ships. Oh, that green one. Get the nose! I didn't come here just to race. Yeah, you came here to lose. But you lost me a long time ago. Think Leaguer will let him win? I don't think he'll beat him, but I think he'll let him win. Oh no. That way he's still Leaguer the best. Leaguer wins, gets some money, and pays for a block or whatever. Yeah, go through spinning rings, Jeez. That's the obstacle course. Jeez. Oh no! Why? What the hell? Why? He just killed that kid. Everything was shocked. Well, you can't be shooting. What are you doing? Nah. Shut up! The first of the racers is entering phase two. When the racers reach the very edge of space. Oh, uh, all the way up. As they pass through the hoop. An ion pulse shuts off their engines. Hmm. It's a hell of a. I left Damn because race. I lost everything. I've been trying to tell you all this time. Ah, uh, ions go out. They can't talk anymore, right? We. They might. The droids are still on. Whoa, that was cool. I like that, isn't he? Yeah. 
bucket. Will he be okay? That's cool. I like this race. If they miss the reignition hoop, their engines won't come back on. Mm. There's a reignition hoop. Mm. You dick. This guy. He's ex Imperial. What do you expect? You good? Pull up. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, speed star. Oh, he uh, missed he it. Missed it. Ah. Ejection! I have to win. <laughs> That's what you've always said. You just want the fame and the glory. That's all that matters though, to you. Dude. I don't win this race. They're gonna die. Like those people who died when you caused that crash. My family, gone. Yeah, Not pretty, anymore, yeah, Jack. Deal, I spent years hunting you down to tell you how sorry I am, to tell you how much I love them too. And you too, brother. I am so sorry. You deserve to win this, brother. You need it. What? And the winner is... Marcus the Speed Star! So he let him win. Yes. Oh, These guys are droids. They're cybernetic. Hot lock! We've got some extra money left over, too, thanks to Jarek here. Some money. Yeah, give him, give him the rest of the money, bro. Let him fix up that fire. It's good to have you back, brother. What's it called? I was just about to say the same thing. You were right. It's important to forgive people. When you don't, nobody wins. Did I say that? Not in so many words. <laughs> I think Eager and I are becoming friends. Maybe not friends like you and I are friends, but... What? We're friends? <laughs> I, I thought you and I were friends. I mean, come on. Oh, yeah, I only have one buddy. Just... His name is Poe. I really enjoyed that episode. A lot more depth into Yeager's character. Yeah. It's screwed up, though, that... I mean... His family died because of that accident? I don't, well, that's is that thing, I, don't, I don't fully understand how it happened. Like, did, the, did they... Crash into they must have crashed the audience. Yeah, that's, 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 that's what happened. That's how I took it. And I have to, I have to admit, I, I don't know if I can ever. Forgive I don't him. know if I can ever forgive him either. I can imagine not hating him. But I just, like, even if you gave him, I never want to see him. Yeah. Yeah. That's I mean. hard, man. That'd be. I mean, like you fought in the Battle of Jakku. Yeah. You're a rebellion pilot, and that's how your family go down. Your brother used Nos. Yeah. You know. Fucking. Vin Diesel. They made up in fucking 15 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. It's a little easy to make up. I mean, he said that he hasn't forgiven him, yeah. but he might one day. Yeah, they're on a track. Yeah. Uh, the, the main thing is seeing that he's not exactly what he was before. He wasn't wanting to win that because he wanted fame and fortune. He was wanting to yeah. win that because he wanted to save his friend, uh, Oblock? Oblock, yeah. Oplock. Oplock, yeah. okay. Oplock. So. Okay, Oplock. <laughs> it's right there. Rishi. Rishi. The Rishi Station. Okay. What's Rishi Station? I, that, that sounds familiar. Okay. If you guys don't know Rishi, then it must be from Swator. I'm going to say Rishi, I know from something. It's got to be It's gotta be that it's from Star Wars Yoda Republic then. Because I was trying to think of what it was Rishi? from. Yeah. No, it sounds old trilogy to me. Rishi. Okay, look it up. No, it's not Tashi. <laughs> yeah, Tashi Converters. Rishi, uh, I think it's like a pirate planet from Star Wars Yoda Republic. Okay, there are species too. Planet of the Homeworld Avian Rishi, Star Wars The Old Republic. A little note on that. Uh, I don't know if... I mean, Star Wars The Old Republic, I don't think, has any canon to it anymore, so... But I like hearing planets that I've heard from other elements of the lore. Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. It sounded familiar as soon as I heard it, but... Yeah, nothing on Rishi but pirates and gun runners. Yeah. So, it looks like they were, it was part of Clone Wars, too, like the old... Uh, Clone Wars, either comics or digest novels or something. Rishi. That's possible. <laughs> yeah, Old Republic, Old Republic, Knights of the Fallen Empire, mm -hmm. Star Wars The Clone Wars, okay. Gauntlet of Death, Rookie. Okay. and then Rookies. They, Rishi Station and Rookies. That's the name of the station they were uh, they were guarding. Oh, okay. Remember the one that uh, has like the eels and stuff? Isn't that the Rishi Station? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Anyway, yes. Uh, yes. We also got the Guavian Death Gang, 
which was from The Force Awakens. They're on the other side of Kanji Club. Like Guavian? Like Guavian. Like, like the Kanji fruit? Club. I think so. There's like a guava, guava yeah. fu- fruit, whatever? Yeah. yeah. There's a foot. Yeah. I, 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 I <laughs> rather would have had Kanji Club, I think. Kanji but Club. those guys were cool. Yeah. They're neat. They all just seem to always have that red style thing on. You know what I mean? Yeah, I think that they... Because I have the action figure. Or I have two of them, I think. Because they came in twos. Anyway, I think that it's like they're described as having either they are droids or they have like a lot of cybernetic stuff in them to make them controlled or something like that. Okay. Like the Death Club has these things. But I don't know if that means that they were like an alien or a human or something that was turned into it. Possibly. But it could be like a kind of lobot yeah, maybe. Something like that. Uh, Those are implants. Right? And maybe I'm completely wrong about that, but I remember that from them, I think. I mean, these guys look so cool, you know? Mm-hmm. So I remember looking it up in the visual dictionary and stuff like that. Okay. What do you think of, uh, so what's Neku's species? Neku, Neku and, Oplo- and uh, yeah, Oplock? Are they supposed to be the same species? No. No, Neku it's, is they're a... They're different, right? They, uh, they look Yeah, they're different. Oh, okay. Man, Neku right. is a, a Nikto, I think. Did I write it down right? at the beginning? Niku. That guy had like... Um, Niku Neku. Niku Niku. Yeah, um, I think he's a Nick Toe. I, didn't, I guess I didn't write down what he. But wore. that guy had like uh, these water gill mm. things on the side of his head. Yeah, like those. Kind of like the like the, the creature from Black Lagoon. Yeah. Okay. They're different. I can see why you think it might be the, the kind of the similar. Other they kind of were. But no, they're different. So you're yeah, like, you're right. These are gills. Yeah, those Neku are spikes. More, he has more of a nose. That guy doesn't have any nostrils. Mm-hmm. What the fuck is that thing? Yeah, they're yeah. nothing like. I don't know. Yeah, they, they all look alike. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> yeah. It's like Empire. Dude, I love the platform classic. Like, I, yeah. I just love... The race itself? I, I love, like, it wasn't just that, okay, guys, how fast can you go? It was like, here's the optical course section yeah. where you gotta watch over the rings, and here's the climb, you, you know, going yeah. against gravity, and here's where you have no power. There's a ring that depowers you, and one that powers you. So yeah. you just glide to That's it. a hell of a cool idea. I love that. That's a hell of a cool idea. It was great. Like, I'd love to see races yeah. like that more. I mean, often. for a race, like, a pod race is cool because you're going through terrain. Like, you know, pod racer, the 64... That was awesome. Mm-hmm. But you have terrain to go through. Yeah, you go These through. are just at, you know, you're not, there's no, like, terrain to go around, really. No. There's the Colossus itself, and there's these rings you have to go through. Yeah, well, with it, with where they are, they just have water. And then they have yeah. the Colossus itself. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Whereas, like, uh, I'm, I was thinking of, oh, shoot, uh, Sin, uh, Sindula. Hera. Hera. Hera? Yeah. Hera, whenever she had the, the B-Wing. Yeah. Right? And there was, like, all those, like pillars and stuff like if you had yeah. something like that and then you had a watery area that was flat sure and then you had like some stuff with like like a cave like at least then you could have a race going through different i'm thinking of like stuff, the boon to eve classic episode one yeah you know like this i, I like this show but it might have been cool to have like a pod racer mm-hmm. kind of thing what, what are pod races like now in this era Is you it know flying instead maybe of the flying maybe yeah. upgraded to this however like right when he said like Somebody, a famous uh, racer was going to come out. Like I know that Han supposedly after the rebellion became a, a racer. Oh really? Yeah. Oh uh, okay. And uh, that, he was like famous for racing. Yeah, it's canon. Okay. And I was like, oh, what was going to be Han Solo? But it was this speed yeah. star guy. That'd be neat. But yeah. you know, with it being his brother Marcus and all that stuff, uh, <clears throat> you think Doza knew any of this? I mean, he just he wanted to get eager to. Um, to, race. to race just because I guess that would cause the betting and stuff to go up yeah I mean maybe maybe he did or maybe it was just like you know maybe if I get his brother who's a known racer he'll yeah. be interested in racing with his brother you know yeah, yeah. yeah that's it, it sounded like uh, the brother had no idea where he was until true he's maybe, been looking maybe at him then Dozen contacted him and that's how he found out where he was or mm-hmm. something you know so I don't I don't know if the history is actually known maybe I mean, it's probably known somewhere about an accident that killed people. I'm, I'm going to guess that he didn't, that he might not have known. Yeah. I'm going to f- also say, like, it's kind of surprising that a racer that seems to be have that much popularity, you know, in his past has a, a moment of cheating and causing a terrible and accident that killed people, people you know? Yeah. I mean, a lot of, like, celebrity athlete type of people, I don't feel like would recover from that. Yeah, I don't know. Twitter. I mean, maybe the fact that Star Wars is so sure. vast of a, of a galaxy, you know, yeah. like you could, you know, that could have happened in the Outer Rim, and now you're over here, maybe yeah. you don't know about it or something, or, you know, whatever. Yeah. I don't know. Well, you guys want to check out some Q&As? Yes. Sure. From Twitter, uh, you can go to at Prod hashtag resistance Q&A to ask your questions. Yeah. 
Andy asks, a brutal backstory for Yeager. He's a saint to even talk to his brother after the horrible accident uh, his cheating caused. Uh, how would you guys handle it if you were in Yeager's place? I don't know, he handled, I, better, I he handled have, it better than me. I think I'm with Shane. Like, I don't know if I can forgive it. I mean, your, your, your kid, you know? Yeah. Like your wife and your kid. I don't know. Of course, that would tear him up, too, but... I mean, it was... It wasn't that he was trying to kill him, either. No. Though. It was an accident, you know? It'd be like yeah, if, you, but, if you left... If, if, if Shane had you watch his kids and you fell asleep and the house burned down because yeah. you did something dumb... Yeah. Like, it wouldn't be like you weren't trying to do that, sure. but it still was your fault. Yeah. But would you would you be blamed for the rest of your life, or is there some? I wouldn't blame him if room? he blamed me for the rest of my life. <laughs> I'd be like, I get you, man. Yeah. I, yeah. You know, like it was like it was supposed to be your job. I was trying to make chicken noodle soup. But even in this situation, it wasn't his job to keep them safe. Yeah. His job was just to race, but he yeah. did a bad thing. So. Yeah. I think there's some wiggle room in there of being like it's not it's not his fault, but it is his fault. Yeah. But I, I don't know. Maybe it's part of like seeing like where he's at now. He's not. You know, if he's not trying to race and get fame True. and he's, you know, looking into family, he really does want to reconnect with a mm -hmm. brother he doesn't have anymore, you know? Yeah. Kind of. Um, classy Critic says, do you think that we will ever see a flashback to the Battle of Jakku in this show, or will it just be mentioned a lot? I don't think we'll see a flashback. No? I don't know. I mean, yeah, we, we kind of have that history there, but I don't know if anything, like, really important to Yeager happened there rather than this being a... You don't yeah. have much flashback to Star Wars you want to see so you get The Last Jedi at least. Yeah. yeah. If you want to see some Jakku, go play Battlefront. Sure. <laughs> Ashley Jenkins, what'd you think of the race this episode? That was one of the... It was great. It. Yeah. yeah. Fantastic. I love that they added in more than just like, we'll race around the Colossus and go through these rings. It was mm -hmm. more than that, which that's what I loved. It yeah. was great. Uh, Skeletor, he says, do you think we will see Maz Katana... Han Solo uh, or Chewbacca make an appearance on the show since I'm assuming Han would be a smuggler again at this point. I think at this point he would be smuggling. Mm -hmm. um, I know that, you know, later, earlier in his life, after the rebellion, he was doing some racing. But, then he went back to smuggling and yeah. then he lost the Falcon and... What did I say? Did I say kan Kanata? Uh, you said... I said Katana. You said something with a T. Okay. Uh, Kanata. Tanaka. <laughs> yeah. Taka Taka. I don't know if we'll see anybody. It'd be cool, but... I mean, Maz, we could see Maz in the Clone Wars. She's yeah. a thousand years old. You yeah. Know? That's what's kind of cool to think about. Yeah. yeah. She knew Yoda, so... I would. I mean, it would be cool to see Han and, and Chewie, but will it take away from our core cast of characters, like, just a show? Yeah. Like, hey, here's a thing, you know? Mm -hmm. It's like, well, if that was the case, just check, give me a Han show. Uh, yeah. Like, why are they coming to this place? Because yeah. it's, it's not like we're traveling around where we see them. It just depends know? how they do it. I, I wouldn't mind having them in there. You know, you don't have to hit, hit it hard on the nose, but just, you don't have to reveal, they don't have to get close. Yeah. Is, is there nothing else on this planet but this station, this Colossus thing? We don't know. So I was just wondering, like, yeah. So I was trying to get, like, Lothal and stuff, you know, like, you know, people showing up for that. And I was like, well, that was, like, the capital of the planet where mm -hmm. they were having things happen, typically. Yeah. With this one, like, is there anything else on this planet? Like, if, say, Leia came to this planet... Is she going to the Colossus, or is she going to somewhere else on this planet? Yeah, like, no. it's a refueling station. I mean, you could still be a refuel... Why would they have it on this big platform that they could put on land? Yeah, I don't know. You know? I, don't, I don't know. All right, last one. This is a cool one. Dr. Winchester says, Who would win in a race? Han in the Millennium Falcon. Han. Hera in the Ghost. Poe in his Black X-Wing. Or Yeager in his Racer. All in their prime. Well, and... Those are different vehicles. I mean, See, Han, I, I think it's a bad way to, me to measure them. Yeah, they are different vehicles. Like, who's the best pilot might be more of a a, a better thing to say. I don't know. Um, like, so, like, Han, the, the Falcon is fast, but it's because it's, you know, like, hyper drive is different than you just your maneuverability. It's been you know? customized and everything else. I, I mean, there's a lot of variables, I guess, like, how far are they going? You know, what kind yeah. of, like, what, like the X-Wing would be much suited for something different than the Falcon would, you know? Yeah. So, so like, you know, you, you might not want the Falcon going into Death Star Trench, but the X-Wing going into Death Star Trench might be good. Yeah. The Falcon can cover it, though, you know? Like, that yeah. works. You can't... So, well, I, I don't know. Who's the best pilot, then? I mean, objectively... I might have Hera to or Poe. Hera I'm, or Poe. I'm between Poe and Han. Yeah? Hera's an amazing I mean, pilot. Yeah, because Hera... I, there's, I think there's these a lot of really big moments where 
they count on her skill. But yeah, but Poe might like as, in terms of being like a stunt fighter. Like that moment in The Force Awakens where he shows up and it's no no. But when he goes out and just kills everything. But that's what Hello Pilot. Where he goes in, he flies in that big circle, yeah. that, that giant dome, and choo 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 choo. Flies back before. out. That's great. But Han also had like that the uh, light speed like into the planet kind of mm-hmm. thing. You know, like that was yeah. Han's got all really the good. You know, like I mean, Hera was a a rebel pilot smuggling for years before Han was doing any rebellion stuff. And mm-hmm. She's, you know, I, I know that he's going in Empire stuff too, but she's being hunted. Well, actually, if he, his back, Han's backstory was he's an unbelievable pilot as well. Yeah. yeah. Well, so Yeager, we're going to say we don't know enough about him to say that he's we don't know enough. even a contender. Yeah. But, I mean, he's obviously has a lot of experience in, like, speed racing. Yeah. These other guys, like Hera, I'm sure she was great, but she's not a racer. Poe is not a racer. He's a combat pilot. Yeah. That's a whole different way of doing yeah. it. Hey, you can be good at cars, but are you good at cars that have fucking machine guns? guns <laughs> Twisted metal, yeah. you know? Yeah. Yeah, I get you. I mean, I guess I guess in general we should go with Poe because all of us said, like, Poe or Han or Poe or Hera. But we're going to go with Poe? I, I think, you know? Yeah. Just because, like, I don't know. Just because of the debate. I don't want to answer. You guys can answer. Huh? You guys can answer. I'm just saying we're all, we'll all say Poe. Shane says Poe. No. You, like, no. you, you said Poe yep. or Hera. I said Poe or Han, and Eric said... Well, now I'm thinking Han more, though. You know what I mean? Yeah, I get you. But you're still thinking Poe. I think of, I think of, I, I think of Han or Hera. That's all Poe has. Just give it to him. Han has a lot more. Poe's a good... Poe ain't got shit. Poe's a good <laughs> fucking fight. He has man. nothing anymore. <laughs> so good. All right. Well, that is the uh, Twitter Q&A. We're going to go into a poll for this week. Best pilot. We can steal that one. Or Poe, Hera, Han. One. You guys want to steal that one? Yep. Who was the best pilot so far in your opinion? Just a pilot. Not just like as best a pilot. racer, not best. No, you you got, don't take into account Falcon or nothing. Just who's the best pilot? You got the man, the myth, the legend, Han Solo. You got Hera, Sendula. You got Poe Dameron and something Yeager. What's his Jer- first name? Jarek Yeager? Jarek Is that it? Jarek. Of those ones, I know there's a lot of great pilots. Luke Skywalker in his heyday. Luke's a good. Is an Skywalker's pilot. a good pilot. You, you Anakin know? is the best. Should we throw Anakin in there? I don't know. No, he's a force the user. The thing I like though is we have no force users. That's These true. Just no force. Pilots. No force users. Just they're pilots. all out. Okay. Find out who's gonna win the poll next week. Oh, he goes to the asteroid field. Uh, you know. Uh. Uh. Guys, thank you for watching this episode of Star Wars Resistance with us. Uh, there's gonna be more, so make sure you subscribe. We'll see you back next week. Check out that poll over at patreon.com slash blindwave. You can check out full length over there as well.